And Sims in to serve. Sterling can get a point. They can win. It gets it over the net. It is set. Spike opportunity for Mawa. They dink it over. Controlled by Sterling. It is set. Dinked over. Mawa controls. Sends it right back. Setting opportunity. Far side. Kreeble slams. It's dug up. Still in play. Mawa just gets over the net. Sterling has it. Another chance for Kreeble. She slams. It's brought right back. Set up. Dinked over the net. Sterling side. They return. Naomi Carter slam. Beautiful slam. And Sterling wins the game one. Sterling wins it 28 to 26 as Sterling back and forth wins game one. It's no bigger hit than that right there. Laurie Grzynski, can they win it in advance? Serves it over, it's set up by Mawa. Set far side, slammed over, Sterling controls, set at the net, they dink it over with Grzynski. Mawa controls, they look to set. They dink it over, controlled by Sterling. Here's a set, here's Applegate, she dinks it over, they still play on. Mawa returns at the net, into the net, Sterling wins! Sterling wins and advances to the state semifinals of group two. Very nice job by Sterling there. Um, keeping the composure even when they were down by four in that final game. They kept their composure and, um, and stayed strong and played his team and finished it off. Yeah, I think in that game you could see why Sterling's such a complete team. You saw a little bit of everything. The real nice set, the great digs. And for a time, I think when Mawa, again, took the, the outside hitters out of the game in the middle part of that game. I saw girls like Anissa Sanchez and Carter come up with key hits in that middle area of the court by the net. And then towards the latter part of the game, that's when Applegate and Kreeble really took over with those outside hits and finished Mawa off to put Sterling in another rematch tomorrow. Nisa Sanchez, Riverdale. right in front of us into the crowd. We will have a post-game show here on Sterling Radio, also on TV19. For our TV audience, we will take a quick break right here. We'll be back with the post-game show.